Hi all, uh, so Picaro here and I'll be showing you one of my first knife designs it's a fixed blade and happily or unfortunately it's second bunch just completely sold out which makes me feel really good because uh, I've received lots of positive feedback for the knife so here it is um, as the box says it's called Jaktar it's under my brand Picaron tools you can see some basic writings here and there so the knife itself on its first batch it was made in D2 steel and the second batch uh, was in 14C28 uh, the two batches came in natural micarta and in OD uh, micarta I've um, put for sale some black micarta scales and some people bought for their already uh, existing knives so the the handles are interchangeable between the batches and you can just change the the, the scale with the core you want um, the knife itself you can see that it's not that big uh, for a fixed blade it's actually a mini fixed blade just a simple uh, check for the size if you haven't seen somewhere in the internet it's 15 centimeters long which is roughly around six inches the blade itself the cutting part uh, of it is like 2.75 let's say I know it's um, it's relatively small blade, but I wanted to keep it, um, let's say, legal in lots of countries because you know that there are lots of limitations and walls around the world. So that's a knife. Uh, black screws with uh, T6, if I remember correct. Uh, screws a uh, nice stone uh, blade with my logo you can see here the deep belly and uh, high grind also you have really nice spearing point where you can use it for tasks like just um, let's say hack something and slice through it you can see that the blade in the in the tip is thinner so to have better penetration and then you have a three millimeters stock blade here you can see i have let's say medium sized hands i have four a full four fingers on the, on the handle with a nice rest place for the thumb on the blade I believe that the knife is actually pretty comfortable and that's what the most review says about it. Okay, and sorry for my English, I'm not a natural speaker. As you, some of you may know, I'm based in Bulgaria, which is in the European Union and Europe. So no uh, import fees for uh the european countries also um for the uk after brexit i can send it right to your door without to be stopped in customs um i want uh mention our dimensions you can see it the name jaktar the current batch, which is sold out, as I've said, 14C28, and I believe it's 
pretty good looking knife. I know some of you wanted a bigger version, we'll see about that. The knife comes with a kydex sheet which snaps just about great. I, I've uh, carried this around a couple of uh, camping trips and I've never had an issue, so the kydex is pretty stable. Um, also, the holes of the kydex sheet, um, you can put any tech walk system to put it on your belt or your uh, backpack, so any tech walk is convenient for this kydex sheet. Okay, let's do some comparison. This is Ontario Rat Model 1. You know it's it's a big folding knife, so you can see how big or small it is compared to the Jaktar, a standard Swiss Army knife. You can see, uh, actually these are really nice pair if you just want something reliable in your pockets. So I just leave this here. My smuggler pry bar in brass. Also really eye-catching for some photos for your Instagram or Facebook. I know a lot of you guys are in uh, Facebook groups for EDC or posting regularly to Instagram. You can see how nice uh, these are matching my uh, Citizen EcoDrive Prospect uh, Pro Diver. Okay, so, and my first folding knife, it's the Mutineer, this one is again with natural micarta, again a really nice pair. The back of this, this one is from Titanium, really great snap, I have uh, some in stock of these. I've got lots of requests to make a bigger version, we'll see about that. I'm really close uh, to completely sold out the second bunch of these too. Maybe I'll make a um, separate review for it because there are lots of like 400 pieces into the wild. So I believe you guys like this knife too. Okay, so I believe this pretty much covers everything about the knife. Thank you for watching. Thank you for uh, getting these, for making even the second run completely sold out. I'm really, uh, it, it really means a lot for me that my, my knives are getting bought, not only for the money, but uh, that my ideas of a modern pirate designs are uh, catch and die if you want or uh, you find them comfortable, you find them suitable for your work or um, easy for work with them because both, both my designs have this, um, let's say, rest piece for the thumbs, for uh, hacking, for slicing, for really uh, hard to work as on the deck of a ship. <laughs> so, thank you so much, it means a lot. Okay, so I think with that I will end the review. It wasn't covering much tests, but uh, with more than 250, I believe, into the wild. You can see photos in Instagram or Facebook. You can see uh, other reviews over YouTube. So you maybe catch a knife from the third batch. We'll see that. Thank you again for watching and have a great one.